Hello, my name is Jordan Fothery. This is my project presentation for hospitality marketing analysis in the Executive Master's Program at the Conrad N. Hilton College at the University of Houston. This is under the instruction of Dr. Chris Taylor, and today's date is Tuesday, June 26, 2018. This project presentation is a marketing analysis on Rosewood Hotels and Resorts. A brief overview of the brand for those unfamiliar with Rosewood. Created in 1979, the brand consists of a collection of highly individual, ultra-luxury, residential-style hotels. The properties are inspired by the local culture and geography of their surroundings, and there are 23 properties open worldwide, with 17 more currently under development. Target marketing, Rosewood Hotels and Resorts profitably targets affluent guests, so the brand's Competitive set includes luxury brands such as Four Seasons, the Ritz-Carlton, and St. Regis. Rosewood brand target customers includes high-end leisure, high-end corporate, and high-end group business. Official results from the 2017 American Express Business Intelligence Survey. Competitor set for the Rosewood brand includes Belmont, Dorchester Collection, Luxury Collection, Mandarin Oriental, and Peninsula. The Rosewood brand actually holds the number one position in this comp set for ADR. The survey shows the official mix of business type in 2017 was 74% FIT, 12% group, and 14% corporate. Rosewood Hotels and Resorts Chief Marketing Officer Carolyn McDonald recently defined the profile of Rosewood guests to include aspirational, affluent, explorers, baby boomers, couples, families, culinary connoisseurs, and millennials. Although millennials may not be their top consumer, they have recognized that they are the future and are making a conscious effort to really focus on their specific needs. Historically, Rosewood has not necessarily been the most appealing brand for young people as compared to other brand choices, like W in addition. Delving into millennials as a target market. Rosewood CEO Sonia Chang is often claimed to be one of the youngest CEOs in the hospitality industry, so she certainly has an understanding for what millennials need in travel. A recent quote from the CEO. What I find interesting is how many companies assume that millennials want completely different experiences than other segments when it comes to travel. In fact, we're seeing that people of all ages, from millennials to baby boomers, are choosing to spend their disposable incomes on meaningful luxury travel explorations and are looking for experiences that tap into the local culture, traditions, and history of a particular destination. As a brand, Rosewood has some key marketing action points geared towards millennial travelers for this current year, which include... Rosewood looking into hosting more client events in individual agency locations, an especially good opportunity to encourage millennial travelers, and Rosewood curator videos from different properties to be played on in-room TVs. The Rosewood brand CMO recently gave some updates on their current marketing, which ultimately includes greater engagement from each property and the process of collecting and showcasing digital content. Rosewood Regulars. <laughs> Their 2017 global brand campaign called Rosewood Regulars, seen here, was geared towards millennial explorers. The campaign features several YouTube videos of travelers in the iconic Rosewood property in Paris. The brand campaign was shot by Pascal Dengen, featuring the hashtag Rosewood Regulars. It is not like a campaign that they have ever done in the past. It is very geared towards a younger demographic. Rosewood Global Give Back Campaign. This is special. At Rosewood, they believe that learning is the foundation of all growth and possibilities in life. They are dedicated to causes which unlock aspirations, develop critical thinking, strengthen knowledge, and unleash potential within a variety of vocations, passions, and talents. The brand asks its clients to join in their global give-back campaign. 
This campaign offers rewarding concessions available at any Rosewood property for group programs confirmed definite by the end of June of 2019. So here's what's included. A 2% donation to Room to Read's Girls Education Program. Room to Read is an initiative Rosewood passionately supports to encourage young girls to prosper in education and life experiences. Alternatively, the donation can also be made to a charitable organization that the company or client is really passionate about. Branding. Of course, every brand has a personality of its own and its own positioning in the marketplace. Brands provide a promise, consistency, and credibility. Brands also give consumers trust in what they are consuming and buying. People generally work really hard for their money and want to buy into things that they trust and that they believe in. Successful brands recognize that everything communicates. For example, the Rosewood brand is consistent on their website, at their city properties, at the resort properties, and especially with the employee messaging. The Rosewood brands offer clear, consistent, and powerful messaging to their consumers. Their consumers feel that they can relate to the brand and are somehow a part of the brand in a way. In fact, I can close my eyes and clearly picture the brand. I can picture the logo, the brand consumers, and what their locations look like around the globe. The Rosewood brand offers a strong mental image. It's what I was talking about. This type of brand is more service-oriented in nature, though, more so than the Apple brand or Target, and less about the actual logo. Yet this brand is still able to recognize that everything communicates. This brand promises and delivers to remain true to who they are as a brand. The brand essence for Rosewood is a sense of place, which is their signature trademarked philosophy. A sense of place is a personal journey of authentic and exquisite discoveries. Rosewood's brand positioning is all about personal journeys and discovery for guests. So their journeys are created through a living canvas of local culture, nature, and unparalleled personal service within the space of the hotel. Sophisticated guests appreciate the many finer things, understated residential style details, and the luxury of simple pleasures inspired by the heritage of Rosewood's first mansion property. Each hotel has a unique story based on its own special personality and location, enhanced by exquisite, dynamic, and unconventional experiences designed to bring a sense of place philosophy to life. When combined with the individual stories of sister hotels, the whole creates a captivating collection. And Rosewood's brand character is all about being distinctive, cultured, timeless, and of course, sophisticated. Rosewood has some brand associations, and those are Aston Martin and Harry Winston. Experiential marketing. Good brands engage with their consumers. This engagement is known as experiential marketing and has a strong tie with branded special events. Experiential marketing is a marketing strategy that engages in consumers and invites them to be a part of the brand and literally experience it. Experiential marketing takes traditional marketing to the next level by targeting consumers' senses and feelings. In fact, the experiential hierarchy includes the modes of sensing, feeling, thinking, acting, and relating. These five modes are really important in creating consumer engagement, which is when a brand and its consumers collide. Experiential marketing is essentially focused entirely on the customer experience. So as you see here, this is an example of what Rosewood does for experiential marketing. This is a sense of taste, which is another signature um, piece of the brand. Um, in this example, you'll see the Dallas Farmer's Market. So guests are actually 
um, picked up in a private car. They're uh, taken um, with the award-winning chef to the farmer's market. They can actually pick out produce um, and um, then go to Clyde Warren Park. It's this whole experience. It's three hours long and it's priced at $150 a person. They're really able to have an experience and get immersed within the brand. Relationship marketing is all about the four C's approach. So relationship marketing is all about understanding the long-term value of consumer relationships by giving them something without instant results necessarily. So something that Rosewood does um, in terms of relationship marketing is Rosewood Conversations. Rosewood Conversations is a very unique newsletter that uncovers um, travel, art, fashion, culture, kind of from a millennial's perspective. Um, also, it ties in with the Rosewood Curators program. Rosewood Curators, um, it's a unique platform, unique to Rosewood, that allows uh, their hand-picked curators to tell their stories through their unique and distinctively personal perspectives and offer a fascinating insight into that hotel, location, that scene. A couple of the curators with Rosewood um, are the fashion icon Zach Posen and celebrity actress Jessica Alba. These curators will actually um, write pieces into the Rosewood conversations. This is, of course, a long-term marketing approach. Um, there's not necessarily short-term gain expected from this. And with any brand, there's always, of course, opportunity to grow the market share by enhancing initiatives, creating new initiatives, too. So here are some enhancements that could be made to attract more customers, and this is my opinion, and these are some of my projections. Um, I would recommend keeping the buzz going with the Rosewood Regulars campaign that we talked about earlier. Um, so since the 2017 campaign launch, there were five videos released, and it was kind of one and done. There hasn't been much traction or movement with that. So I think that another set of videos could be launched to keep the momentum going. Next, um, I think that the Rosewood Conversations tool um, is on the right track. I think that it could be more appealing to youth, though, when you really dig into the content. For instance, I would recommend including stories about relevant celebrities Celebrity buzz, like recent run-ins at some of the Rosewood properties. Um, ad curators, maybe with more name recognition. Again, celebrity works. That's what they're going for, so just more, more name recognition to create more buzz and ultimately more ROI. And millennials may not be their top consumer, but that's what I want to chat about next. So just like... Um, what the Navy has done, um, the brand is wanting to make a conscious effort to focus on their specific needs. However, I still think there's plenty of room for growth, um, so I think spending more time delving into what they would need would be a good um, move forward. Thank you so much for your time. I hope that you enjoyed the presentation.